watching WSBT First at Four. A new restaurant debuted this week in Mishawaka, and plans for a new restaurant were unveiled this week in Niles as well. South Bend Tribune columnist Heidi Prescott joins us with all the details on both of those projects. Heidi, let's start with Mishawaka and that taste of India we're talking about. Parking lot certainly crowded this afternoon for lunch. Yeah, Jennifer, diners had trouble finding a space because this is just day two for Taste of India. It's always fun to try a new restaurant or even a new cuisine. And the diners I spoke with today said Taste of India does not disappoint. It's located in the Old Mancinos on North Main Street. Over the last three months, it has been completely renovated. Okay, so for someone who's never tried Indian food, how do you describe the menu? Yeah, you know, in full disclosure, I have to confess it. before today, I'd never tried Indian food, so I had no idea it would taste so flavorful. The chef actually took us behind the scenes and showed us more than 50 raw spices that he uses at his entrees. The shredded butter chicken and warm naan, fresh out of the oven, those were my favorites. But if you prefer a little kick, I'd recommend the chili chicken. Um, there's a lunch-only buffet if you want to sample more than one entree and then menu ordering for dinner. Ooh, it sounds really good. I think the sampling always helps when you're trying something new, too. You know, there's something new planned for the Riverfront Cafe in Niles. We've all been past it. It's been closed for a while, so what can you tell us? Yeah, new owners from Niles are planning to reopen that restaurant next spring. They don't plan on changing much inside the building, which is on Front Street down from Wonderland Theater. The first floor dining room and patio will seat about 200, and the upstairs will be a cafe and a lounge but the name of the restaurant and the menu will be completely different the brother and sister who bought it are both vegetarian so they're planning to focus on fresh and healthy all right Heidi thank you very much and you can read more about these restaurants in Heidi's column it appears Wednesdays and Sundays in the South Bend Tribune and at southbendtribune.com